looking for a fun movie to watch. Check out Tarzan Escapes. This film from 1936 is a mix of adventure, humor, and heart, making it an enjoyable ride. Get ready for exciting escapes, funny moments, and touching friendships in the wild world of Tarzan. Now, let's talk about some memorable parts. Is there a scene or moment that stood out to you? It could be Tarzan's loud yell or an intense chase through the trees. Share your thoughts on the characters too. Do you prefer Tarzan Jane or the tricky villains? The cast is vibrant, making it tough to choose just one favorite. And if you have any personal stories or experiences with this movie, feel free to share in the comments below. Get your popcorn ready for a wild adventure with Tarzan Escapes. You won't want to miss it. Tarzan Escapes is a 1936 movie that follows the adventures of Tarzan, a man who was raised by apes in the African jungle. The plot revolves around Tarzan's efforts to protect his jungle home and his loved ones from outside threats. The setting is lush and wild, depicting the untamed beauty of the African wilderness. The main characters include Tarzan, who is portrayed as a strong and noble hero, Jane, his love interest who accompanies him on his adventures, and Cheetah, Tarzan's loyal chimpanzee companion. Throughout the movie, they encounter various challenges, including greedy treasure hunters and hostile tribes, but they always manage to overcome them through courage and resourcefulness. Tarzan Escapes premiered in 1936 and received positive reviews for its thrilling action sequences and stunning cinematography. The movie was praised for its groundbreaking special effects and became a classic of the adventure genre. It won several awards for its innovative filmmaking techniques and has since become a beloved favorite among audiences of all ages. The movie underwent significant changes during production. Originally directed by James C. McKay, it saw a major overhaul when John Farrow took over, reshooting most of the film. Various cast and crew alterations occurred, including the addition of Herbert Munden and Darby Jones, while Granville Bates was removed from the cast. Cheetah, the chimpanzee, received solo credit in the opening casting credits. Tragically, actor John Buckler, who portrayed Captain John Fry, passed away in a car accident just before the film's release, never having the chance to see the finished product. In this movie, Jane's two-piece outfit got changed to a one-piece suit because people thought the old one showed too much. She still doesn't wear shoes. The yell Tarzan makes was made up by Johnny Weismuller when he was a kid, and everyone remembers it from his movies as Tarzan. Johnny asked for that yell to be played at his funeral when he died. It was a good way to remember him. In the 1936 movie, there were interesting things happening behind the scenes. For example, they used fake ears on the elephants to make them look like they belonged in Africa, even though they were actually from Asia. Also, the tusks on the elephants were made of rubber and were not fixed tightly so they could move during filming. The actor Johnny Weismuller, who played Tarzan and was the first one to speak in the role, passed away in January 1984. Around the same time, the last Tarzan who acted in silent films, James Pierce, also passed away. This marked the end of a special time for Tarzan movies. Maureen O'Sullivan, who played an important role in the Tarzan movie, is remembered for more than just her acting. There's a robot version of her character at Disney's Hollywood Studios, which used to be part of a different ride. They changed its clothes when they moved it to a new ride, keeping a piece of movie history alive. All these little details and the people involved have left a lasting impression on the Tarzan movie from 1936, showing how the character has changed over time. In Tarzan Escapes, tragedy struck off screen as both actors portraying Rollins and Captain Fry met on timely deaths in car accidents. One actor crashed while the other drowned. Interestingly, the Haman tribesmen seen in close-up shots were portrayed by Maasai individuals. Throughout the film, Swahili phrases like Kujahapa are used frequently, albeit sometimes inaccurately, with instances like Kujakwendigo. Most of this dialogue is spoken by one of the African lead actors, who is clearly American. In the movie, Johnny Weismuller faced challenges off-screen as well. His tumultuous marriage to Lupe Velas garnered attention from Hollywood scandal sheets. The makeup man on set had his work cut out for him, covering up bruises and scratches from their frequent fights. Weismuller eventually left after an argument where Velas confessed to killing his dog. In retaliation, he took the life of her parrot, which amusingly called him Gary, a nod to Velas's previous relationship. Meanwhile, Tarzan and Jane's treehouse evolved into a Swiss family Robinson-style home with modern amenities like running water and an elephant-powered elevator. Interestingly, Maureen O'Sullivan and John Farrow tied the knot shortly after filming wrapped up. In encountering the Haman chief, Captain Fry responds to the chief's greeting Jambo by saying Jambo Sama instead of the correct response Jambo Sana. The more appropriate response would be Hugh Jambo. 
Johnny Weissmuller, known for his role in the film, made a cameo appearance alongside former co-star Maureen O'Sullivan in The Finks. Interestingly, it was the only movie in which he uttered the famous line, Me Tarzan, you Jane. Maureen O'Sullivan, who starred in Tarzan Escapes, appeared in three films recognized by the National Film Registry for their cultural significance Tarzan and his mate, The Thin Man and The Tall T. The movie grabs your attention with its familiar scenes from earlier Tarzan films, like the ones with trees, mountains, and wild animals. It's interesting how Johnny Weissmuller, the main actor, doesn't show up until about 23 minutes into the story. The setting feels alive, with thick forests making you feel like you're right in the heart of Africa. The movie keeps you hooked, with each scene building up to an exciting finish. Despite using familiar ideas, Tarzan Escapes brings new excitement to the series, keeping audiences entertained with its mix of action and adventure. It shows how the Tarzan story keeps captivating people, proving its lasting popularity through the years. During the filming, Maureen O'Sullivan had a difficult time with the chimpanzee cheetah. She privately referred to the primate as that ape son of a bitch, according to her daughter Mia Farrow. Interestingly, the titular character of the film doesn't make an appearance until 23 minutes into the feature, which matches the duration from the previous installment. Additionally, footage of the Murchison Falls in Africa, originally shot for another film, Trader Horn, was repurposed for this movie. It provided an authentic touch to the African setting depicted in the film. In one notable incident, Johnny Weismuller had a close call in Cuba during the time of the Cuban Revolution. While playing golf with his friends, he found himself suddenly surrounded by a group of Fidel Castro soldiers intent on kidnapping them or worse. Thinking fast, he immediately gave his trademark Tarzan yell. The soldiers recognized it and were so delighted to meet Tarzan that they began to clap and escorted the group back to a safe area where Weismuller was presented with a $100 bill. It was a moment of quick thinking and recognition that saved the day for Weismuller and his companions. In a tragic turn of events, a significant actor from the movie, Harry Holt, passed away shortly after filming due to illness, leaving a void in the production. The film offers an exciting peek into the adventures of a man raised by apes in the jungle. Directed by Richard Thorpe, it features Johnny Weismuller as the jungle hero, Maureen O'Sullivan as Jane, and the memorable cheetah the chimpanzee. Throughout the story, viewers are drawn into a thrilling tale as the protagonist strives to protect his jungle home from threats. The movie's stunning jungle scenery and thrilling action sequences keep audiences engaged. Despite facing challenges like bad weather and logistical issues, the film remains a beloved classic among adventure cinema fans worldwide. Its lasting impact continues to captivate audiences, showcasing the jungle hero's unwavering spirit. In a surprising twist, one of the actors in the 1936 film encountered a tragic accident while shooting. Despite safety measures, an unexpected incident led to a stunt double getting hurt. This unfortunate event cast a shadow over the production, reminding everyone of the risks involved in creating such daring scenes. As the story unfolds, viewers get drawn into a heartbreaking tale of loss and sacrifice. The emotions portrayed on screen connect with audiences, leaving a strong impression on their movie experience. Through compelling performances and moving storytelling, the film captures the audience's attention, immersing them in a world filled with love, danger, and redemption. Throughout the movie, the characters show resilience, providing a glimmer of hope amidst challenges. Despite facing tough situations, they persist, embodying the enduring strength of the human spirit. Their journey highlights the power of determination and the bonds that bring people together in tough times. When the credits roll, viewers are left with a sense of wonder and respect for the timeless story they've just watched. The 1936 film Tarzan Escapes goes beyond its time, making a lasting impression on cinematic history. Its impact continues to connect with audiences, reminding us of the enduring strength of storytelling. During the filming of a movie back in 1936, something really scary happened. One of the main actors, Johnny Weismuller, almost got seriously hurt by a lion. They were shooting a scene where he had to fight the lion, but the lion attacked him unexpectedly. Luckily, Weismuller survived and kept going with the filming. In this movie, the story takes us deep into the jungle, showing all the tough stuff Tarzan and his friends have to deal with. It's full of suspense, making you sit at the edge of your seat as you watch them face danger after danger in the wild. As the story unfolds, you get to see how Tarzan and Jane stick together through thick and thin. It's really emotional, seeing how they never give up no matter what challenges they face. Even though making the movie wasn't easy, Tarzan Escapes is still loved by many today. It's a reminder of how awesome Tarzan is and how much people still enjoy his adventures. 
Amid the filming of a movie back in 1936, tragedy struck when a stuntman fell during a scene, leading to his untimely death. This incident reminded everyone of the risks involved in such ambitious projects. The movie took a different path compared to previous ones, focusing on our main character's dangerous journey through various challenges and enemies. New characters added depth to the story, making each interaction crucial to the plot. The film's stunning scenery and exotic locations further immerse viewers in the jungle's world, creating a sense of adventure and suspense. Despite the hardships faced during production, the movie succeeded, leaving a lasting impression on audiences worldwide. Its endurance showcases the resilience and creativity of those involved in its creation. Even in the face of tragedy, filmmaking persevered, ensuring that Tarzan's thrilling escape would captivate audiences for years to come.